it was. Did you like that? I loved it. Jamal Binkley, Black Tree TV. Uh, thank you guys uh, uh, for for the time. So I've I love season three. It was, it's been a great adventure. Um, my first my first question is to, to Aiden. You know, as the character five, I, I'm curious. Do you have a lucky number? And if so, like, what is it? Uh, I have a lucky year, just 2007. Uh, it's, it's, it or, originated from like John Mayer's Where the Light Is concert coming out then. But yeah, that's it. I don't have a lucky number, just like, do you have a lucky number? 17. There you go. There you go. <laughs> What's yours? Uh, what, what were you gonna say? I was just asking your lucky number, but we can move on. I, I think eight, I think eight is my lucky number. Love Solid it. number. One plus seven, eight. Yeah. We can be yeah, friends. Even choice. I, I, Rita, I'm curious because I know that you have a band and um, I think it's named Ken, right? Yeah. And and you was and you got a Bachelor of Science in Astrophysics. So I wonder, like, you know, having all these different interests and, and stuff, like, how how does acting fulfill, like, all the other stuff that you want to do? Like, do you feel like you want to still do stuff in Astrophysics or do you look for like, scripts and stories that deal with that? And how do you you know interact with your music and, and acting? Does any of it blend through? Cool question. Um, I feel like it does come hand in hand. I think it's pretty healthy for me to have um, interests in things other than just acting because it gives me perspective and there's a lot that's out of your control with this crazy job. So it keeps me happy. I really enjoy it. It's like, something really simple about just going into a rehearsal room and picking up a pair of drumsticks and just drumming, you know? And um, so I think I'm, I'm always into like different things and, and, and finding interest in other stuff, but it does all, yeah, I think it all lends itself. Yeah. Um, Aiden, it's, you, it's been, I guess, four years since you started filming uh, this character and huh? you're supposed to be ageless. And of course, you're growing as a, as a young man and everything. Yes. Uh, I wonder, like, as a character, like, are there certain things that you can't do in the off season? Like, as far as like, you know, everybody always wants to experiment with their looks and everything else because you still have to keep kind of like this ageless boy look uh, in, in while while in character. Yeah, I take uh, gross stunting stuff, but uh, no. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I have a, like a, a side theory that sort of a product of his weird de-aging that he's sort of like on a reverse exponential curve where he's aging really quickly and then it'll eventually level off. Because uh, if we shoot the show long enough, I'll eventually like reach the look of like my 20s and then slowly, you know, go into third. I don't know. I don't know if I'm still growing. It's not up to me. Don't put me off guard like this. Never I feel uncomfortable. Growing. Wouldn't that be weird? You're just gonna Cats be getting taller and taller. Until like interrupt Tom us in the, in the key artist like oh, we'll just that? carry on otherwise. <laughs> well, last question: If if you guys could uh, live in a in a, another timeline, some optimal timeline, like what would be some of the things that you would want to just experience or see how it would be if it was different? Like if you could be in, a, if you could create your own multiverse that you fell into, like what would it look like? Ah. Uh. Wait, is it a what period of time would you go live in, or you can create a I universe? I mean, what period of time, like stuff could be different, you know, like uh, you know, it could be, I don't, know. I don't know. The creators do a good, a way better job than me, but like, uh, like it, it, even that, even if it's just a timeline, what period I mean, would you? Uh, what you go in? I don't know about timeline, but love the multiverse idea. Like, obviously, like a world where there was equality and no war. Um, but on a more of a fun side, how about of the world that's just like everything's made of chocolate and, and candy? What about both? <sighs> yeah, why why like to the multiverse have both? I think that would be it. <laughs> Thank you guys for your time. I can't wait to the rest of the fans get to see season three and uh can't wait to talk to you guys again. 20 that's years right. later, Aiden, when you're done. Ageless reverse agent Benjamin ah. Brian guy. <laughs> Peace out. Take care. Peace.